Bookmarks is one of the greatest features of Visual Studio that is unfortunately hardly ever used. Basically, you put bookmarks in various parts of the code to remind you that you need to get back there and do something. This is often very useful when you're focusing on a task, but you see a problem somewhere else in the code. You don't want to get distracted from the original task at hand. So you just leave a bookmark there and get back to your original task. Later, you can look at all your bookmarks and get back to do whatever you wanted to do. Let's see this in action. Imagine you're in the middle of a task and you spot something here in method one. You don't want to get distracted. So you leave a bookmark here by pressing Ctrl and K twice. Note this little icon here. This represents a bookmark. To see all your bookmarks, press Ctrl and W as in short for window and then B as in short for bookmark. Note that the bookmark I just created is listed here. You can double click it and change its name to something more meaningful, like requires refactoring. I know what you're thinking. You're probably saying, Mosh, didn't you advise me not to use the mouse while programming? Yes, I did say that. To be honest with you, at the time of recording this video, I don't know a way to rename a bookmark without using the mouse. Hopefully, one day when I figure it out, I will update this video and teach you and everyone else how to do it. Note that you can remove a bookmark by selecting it here and then clicking the delete icon here. But you can also remove it in the code. Position the cursor on the line where you have a bookmark and then press Ctrl K twice. So let's recap. Press Ctrl K twice to set or remove a bookmark. Press Ctrl W and then B to view the bookmarks window.